Tonight from Oxford, Mississippi, Kentucky hits the road looking to bounce back from a home loss to Kansas and Ole Miss looks for a signature victory. Up the inbound, Abram lost Wheeler and drilled the jumper. Amari Abram runs the point for Ole Miss, gets into Wheeler and scores over the top of it. Abram, got it. Brakefield's a great shooter, and now he dishes it. And it goes for Javis McKinnis. But they've been great on their baseline out of bounds and in the half court executing. Abram for three, got it! Oscar trying to post up and they got it pushed way out and then the loose ball's taken away by Ole Miss. Reeves just fumbled it, lob and a flush! T.T. Caldwell flying in! In the short shoot around, it's paying off for him now. He's battling with Akuba inside. Collins fighting for the rebound, kept alive by Ole Miss. Beautiful finish by Brakefield. Great encouragement as Collins comes off. I haven't seen John Kelly Perry smile that big in a while. Bucket the other way. Impressive wins on the road at Tennessee and at home against the Texas A&M team. It's really had a fantastic run in conference play. Here's Caldwell. Got it. Abram probes. Here's Allen. Right into Toppin who tried to take the charge. It ends up being a bucket and no whistle either way. Here's Allen. Back cut for Burns, and it's tipped in. Long two. Used every bit of the rim before going. He's got a half dozen now. And a bucket inside. Earlier in the season, Kentucky defensively was picking up the ball in the backcourt, almost 70 feet from the basket. They kind of changed and went to Calipari's old UMass defense to avoid getting beat off the dribble and a follow tip. McKinnis got behind Oscar. It, it seems ball screen defense is just such a basic defensive situation, and now McKinnis gets it once again off that high ball screen. She went all alone. They couldn't get it. It's stolen away by Burns. Oh, and he jams it home. They've been outscored 22-13. She went with the steal. Oscar takes it all the way in for the jam. John Calipari had a tough time putting in the game because he couldn't trust him defensively. Yeah. But now that, again, that defense has come along and his confidence on the offensive end. You're exactly right. If he doesn't come back, this could be a totally different game with an inexperienced the arrow. Off the screen, another three. The past few weeks, instead of letting the ball stick, there's that same play. That's and I, th I think that's a point that shouldn't be lost on a fan base who sometimes all fans think a lineup change is as easy. Nice, beautiful finish there by Miles Burns. And the Kentucky Wildcats had to come in and take care of business, and they did just that.